Okay, now I want to cover something, just focus on something called complete and incomplete. Now, from the previous videos, you saw different levels and what the bone versus the, the, the nerve does to create uh, a level of injury, but complete and incomplete. That's very important because you can be a C3 up here, incomplete, and be able to walk. Maybe you can't, but there's so very so much variability if you're incomplete. So basically, the spinal cord is like a telephone wire. All of these fibers running through it. Some of them are tracks of motor. Some of them are tracks of sensory. So when you have an incomplete injury, some of it is damaged. So you may get some of these nerve fibers going through, so you can move something. Some of the nerve fibers not going through, that may be sensory, and vice versa. So that is really important to understand. So when we talk about a neurological level you and a functional outcome based on that level, usually what we're talking about is a complete. So we're taking a theoretical complete level and this is that's what you should do. Incomplete, everything's, everything changes. So here's what, how do you tell incomplete and complete? It's simple. There's only one way. And it's a rectal exam. So there are four parts of the rectal exam that are very important. That is light touch, pen prick, Deep anal pressure, that is when you have a, when the, when the professional has their finger uh, inserted into the rectum, so deep anal pressure, and then voluntary anal contraction. So those are four ways that you can test, and any one of the four would make you incomplete. You know, the person doing the test of the voluntary anal contraction has to make sure that's not a reflex. But any one of those four, you are incomplete. If you don't have any one of those four, you aren't complete. You can have what's called a zone of, partial, par, zone of partial preservation below your level. So you may be a C7, but then you can feel maybe something on your leg or some trunk. But then if you don't have the rectal, one of those four, you're still complete. So that kind of hopefully clarifies complete versus incomplete.